Hello everyone, happy to see you here and in this video we are going to solve the very simple algebra problem, this is a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. And I don't want you to use your calculator right here because here is a problem, as you can see 130 minus 20 and divided by 2. So what is the correct answer? Of course most of you out there are like yes I can handle this, I can handle this problem, this is basic subtraction, basic division, I learned this stuff in the third grade, so that's fantastic. So go ahead and put your answer into a comment section and we'll check our answer here in just one minute, it'll be really interesting to check our answer and I hope it's really interesting and important problem. Okay, because obviously whatever order we select is going to create a different answer, right? So right here we have option A, B and C, so choose one option, what do you think is a correct option to this problem and write your answer into the comment section, okay? Okay, but before solving this, I'm going to show you this solution to this problem, okay, 130 minus 12, 20 and divided by 2. A lot of students solve it like that and I don't, I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, I'm going to show this solution because a lot of students solve it in their obvious way, so they say, okay, 130 minus 20, okay, this is equal to 110 and we have this division by 2 which is equal to like 55, yeah, so they say, okay, 55, option A, this is the first option, so they say, okay, option A is a correct answer to this problem. But then I show them this order of operation, so doesn't matter what order of operation do you select, I prefer PMDMC, or doesn't matter, you like Bodmans, doesn't matter, every of these, uh, each of these uh, order of operation, this is really interesting and really good order of operation, you know, in my case, I prefer PMDMC, okay? And so look at this PMDMC once more, we have 130 minus 20, and divided by 2. Let's look at this PMDMC right here, okay? So we have, what is the first step? Parentheses. Are there any parentheses right here? I don't see any of those, we don't have any parentheses right here, so let's go to the next step. Next step, exponents. So are there any exponents right here? No, I don't see any of those, we don't have any exponents, squares, cubes, which is really great. What about the next step? We have multiplication and division part. And let's scan. Are there any multiplication and division part right here? Okay, let's look at it. We have subtraction. Yeah, right here we have division part. So it looks like we need to start from this, from this step on the right hand side with this division. Because if we divide it, we have like 20 divided by 2 equal to 10. So we have like 130 minus 10 equal to 100 and 120. But we don't have this option and a lot of students like uh, say, okay, we don't have this 120, then 55 is a correct answer, even they, even they solve it in a correct way, but, but they don't see uh, this correct answer right here, okay? And a lot of students go back to this 55, they say, okay, 55 is a correct answer, but my answer is right here, this is absolutely incorrect approach, because we cannot like jump from left to right, we cannot start from subtraction, this is the obvious solution, but this is wrong solution, what about a correct solution? this is a correct solution. But right here we need to solve it, we need to choose one option and what is the correct option to this problem? Because 120, this is not A, this is not C. What about this B? We have 5 factorial and let's remember about factorial real quick. Because we know that factorial this is a product from 1 to until this number, yeah? In our case we have 5 factorial, so until 5, yeah? 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5, okay? Let's look at this uh, product. 1 times 2, 2, 2 2 times 3 we have 6, 6 times 4 24 and 24 times 5 120. This is brilliant because this is equal to 120 which is absolutely the same as of course 5 factorial and this 5 factorial this is absolutely the same that our answer we have 120 a correct answer according to PMDMC so we can easily write our answer right here so we have our answer we have our answer, this is 5 factorial, which is option, option B, and if you're talking about the exact value, 120. This is a solution to this problem, really like relaxing algebra problem, nothing hard I guess, but I hope your answer is the same as mine, but if you made this error, i happy you made this, because you won't make this error again. I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure, thank you for your time and have a great day, see you in the next videos.